Hi, welcome to our Moodle e-learning platform uh, tutorial, which is going to help us to, to show you how uh, University of Zambia students are going to be able to uh, access their Moodle platform and uh, access the material online and also be able to respond to assignments that have been given. I'm using um, standard uh, internet, so uh, this is for demonstration sake to be able to show that it's going to be easy for you also out there wherever you are as long as you have a bit of internet. Uh, I'm also using my favorite browser, Google Chrome. You're free to use any other browser, Safari, Internet Explorer, Edge, uh, or Mozilla Firefox that can be found on uh, your tablet, your phone, smartphone that is, uh, and also any other laptop or desktop computer. So I'm going to go straight uh, in the URL area here to go to University of Zambia's website. That's www.unza.sidem. Once I log into the Unza website, this is my homepage for our favorite uh, website. Uh, all I need to do now is to go to the students menu click over there and that guides me to this other page here where we have our right side navigation uh, side here and we have e-learning there and that's just the two steps that you're going to use to be able to reach Moodle or if that's not too much to remember you can basically go to moodle.unza.zm and um, you are going to have access to this page. Now on this page, um, just to remind you, our students, that you need to be registered uh, on SIS for you to be able to access Moodle. Now on SIS, you can just log in, whether you're registered or not, whether you're waiting payment or when you're waiting approval, but for you to access the material on Moodle platform, you need to be registered on SIS. And then you're going to enter your credentials here. So your SIS credentials are the ones you're going to use to log in here. Your password and your username for SIS are the same ones you're going to use here. No need to create new credentials. Right. So I uh, logged in with my credentials and I've just been logged into my dashboard on Moodle. Uh, I'm a registered student. So I, I have... Uh, my dashboard is showing me all the various uh, courses that I am registered um, as, as as shown also on a student information system. Uh, I'm going to just show you a few things that you are going to look at um, right on this dashboard. So on my left side here is just another representation of uh, my dashboard really with my courses that are assigned to me. Uh, right on top here, I also have the same uh, structure over there. And uh, I can go into a course, say for example, this advanced techniques of demographic analysis. So I have uh, details that were put, content that was put by my lecturer here. And, uh, you know, various things, if uh, there are assignments or if there are uh, any notes that have been given, that content is going to be seen uh, once I get into the course. Join me in part two as we look at how to be able to uh, upload and view my assignments. Thank you.